Hi, I'm Bonnie Browning. I'm here at AQS Quilt Week in Daytona Beach, Florida with two of our winners, Laura Douglas and Linda Hungerford. And you made a really fun quilt. How about telling us a little bit about how you went about making this together? We became friends over the internet through our blogs. And Linda asked me if I would like to help her teach an improv block class at Quilt Guild of the Villages in the Villages, Florida. And I said, I've never made an improv block before. So we uh, picked a color palette from designseeds.com and we, we pulled from our scraps and just started making blocks. And when we got done with the blocks and taught the class, she says, well, what are we going to do with this now? And I said, well, why don't we make a quilt and, and, and submit it to QuiltCon? And so then we went to a retreat together and laid out the quilt blocks. And I think I'm, she made four blocks and I made five blocks. Right. The fifth block we made at the retreat. And then we decided on the layout and I put the quilt top together and she took it home and quilted it. And then I took it back home and did the binding. Yeah. Okay. Now, Linda, tell yeah. us a little bit about this group at the Villages okay. because this is no small group. No, um, Quilting Guild of the Villages is about 1,035 members right now. Um, and the Villages itself is close to 130,000 people. So you gotta get a perspective on that. And we have 19 chapters and the chapters meet every week to get together to, to do uh, activities as a group, somewhere from 40 to 60 people at a time. And then once a month, they have uh, an evening meeting with a speaker in a program. And then I'm also the founder of the Central Florida Modern Quilt Guild. And that's really where this quilt came from. But it was a result of teaching uh, modern quilting to the Quilting Guild of the Villages people. So, so you have lots of quilters in your oh, we area. Do. Then, we do. We sure do. You? Yes, yes. Well, that's fortunate because. I'm glad we brought this wonderful quilt show oh, here yeah, to yeah. Daytona Beach. It's great Beach. to have a, a quilt show in Florida like this. It's wonderful. Mm -hmm. yeah. and, and have you ever attended an AQS event before? This is my first time, but Linda's been oh, to several. Yeah, I've been to, I, I'm from Des Moines, Iowa, so um, went to the numerous shows in Des Moines and Paducah as well. So this is fun to come to a different venue. This is a great venue. It's a great venue, and, and it's nice to have it close to home. Yeah, it, it is. It's not too far away. <laughs> well, now, we were talking a little bit about the quilting, and you yes. did something special yeah. to make your quilt. Well, it, you know, when you have a lot of negative space like this quilt has, all the white area around it, behind it, it you, you have a, just a, like an empty, empty canvas and you don't know where to start, at least I didn't. And I did do this on my home sewing machine. So my um, first thought was to just plant something really big in the middle of it. So um, there's a large circle here in the center and that is um, the circle I drew was from a glass top nightstand table. <laughs> And I actually laid the glass top on the quilt top and then I drew around that circle and I stuck, actually quilted it from the outside of the circle to the inside. So that was the first piece I got in there. Once I got that big center uh, design placed, then I started doing the smaller circles around it. And the smaller circles are easier to find templates for than that big one was. <laughs> well, that was very creative, though, Thanks. for you to find a top like that to yeah, make the well, great big circle. Yeah, yeah, well, what can you do, you know? <laughs> and so have either of you ever entered an AQS event before? Um, I entered a show in Grand Rapids last year in the modern category. Yeah. And I entered in Des Moines one time, and it was juried in, too, so okay. one time. But no ribbons before, so this is yeah, super exciting. Is and you know what? The ribbon is really the icing on the cake, it is, isn't it? It is, it is. The it's phone call thrill. from her yesterday <laughs> afternoon was fabulous. Yeah. <laughs> well, we're glad that you entered, and you know what? You could be standing here and being interviewed as one of our winners, mm -hmm. but you have to enter to be able to win. So we still have some deadlines coming up for our fall shows this year. So go to quiltweek.com and check out the contest rules under the contest heading. And maybe you can be our next winner. Come see us at AQS Quilt Week.